Welcome to a great episode of What's the 411. We have a treat for you guys today. This is Natasha Leaf. And let me tell you something. This is something that we haven't done so far on this show. So we're excited. So we just want to like get started, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. So Natasha, right? So she is the motivational spiritualist. And so what does that mean, really? So um, I have a gift where I can read people's past, present, and future. And I call myself a motivational spiritualist because I utilize my gift to actually motivate people and empower and inspire them to propel in life and to have clarity, to know where they're going, to, to live a purposeful life and to be inspired. So that's why I call myself a motivational spiritualist, not psychic. Okay, right. so not psychic. Right. Not psychic. Okay. No. Okay. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Like a spiritual okay. guide or like a spiritual advisor, yes. spiritual guidance. Yes. yes. So how did you discover your gift? Well, I was six years old and my mom and I were sitting at the table. She was drinking coffee and I was having a bowl of cereal, like an average six year old. And um, I was just I started talking to my mom about some health issues that was coming up for her friend. And I was hmm. like, Mom, you know, what's going on with Miss Boone? And she was like, Nothing. And I'm like, No, she's sick. She's having a heart condition. You know, something's going on. And they're she's like, She's like, What? You're six. <laughs> what are you yeah. talking about? Yeah. 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 And I was like, No, no, yeah, seriously. You know, she's six years old. And remember back in the day when the phones were hanging up on the wall? Yeah. Remember that, yes. right? Yeah. So she's like, I said, You might want to call her. She has some doctor's appointments. You know, she's sick and you need to go visit her and talk to her. So she said, What, girl? Let me. So she picked up the phone and was like, Let me call her. She said, boom, girl, what's going on with you? Tasha, sitting here talking crazy, talking about your heart. She goes, Audrey, oh, my God, I have an appointment. I've been having chest pain. There's something with my wow. heart. Wow. And at that moment, my family realized that I had a gift. What? So, But I hate it. <laughs> That's amazing. Wow. That six years old. Look, it's, it's wow. Shocking. Yes. Oh so I'm, I'm convinced that I was born with it. Because at mm, six absolutely. years old. Exactly. You know? Exactly. So, yeah. But I hit the gift up until I was 24. Why? Why? I was afraid of it. I thought I was weird. I thought I was spooky. You know, I, I knew everyone's business in school. My teachers, this, my friends. Oh, that would be good. Yeah, right. Oh, well, it is. Oh <laughs> because one of my teachers, you know, in my mind, you know, I'm like, she's going to have a baby. She's going to have a baby. She's going to have a boy. She's going to have a boy. And then she came to the classroom a few weeks later and announced, oh, kids, I'm having a baby. I'm like, you know, but these are things that I knew. Like, I always right. knew who was going to be valedictorian, you know, wow. who was going to, like, you know, be with the most popular boy in the school. Right. Like, I just knew everything. Do you just so. see it? Do you, like, look at Courtney mm -hmm. and then see her doing something? Or do you just feel it? Or I what feel is it? it. And it just comes to me. What are you um, feeling right now? Are you feeling anything right now? Yeah, I'm feeling a lot of positivity. I'm definitely yeah. sitting around a powerful group of women right now. Yeah, we um, fight like that. Yeah. 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 We like, hold up, bitch. Yeah. 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 Women who are really up to things, you know, really up to things, good stuff, empowerment things. You know, yeah. Anika, I know you have a, a million and one things going on. No, do, do. Um, very, like, forceful. A lot of great projects that I see you working on. Phenomenal projects um, with a lot of group of people within the entertainment world. Not just um, the 411, mm -hmm. but I see you working on other things with some other people like L.A. L.A. is coming up to me. Um, I don't know if you have a contact in L.A. or someone else. Yeah. Not your yeah, friend. Um, <laughs> but it's someone else. It's no, not okay. just her. Mm -hmm. It's someone else. It's not her. Mm -hmm. I know you are going to say that, but it's not her. Mm -hmm. It's another connection that you have in L.A. Um, that's going to really, really support you in a massive way. And that's going to grow a huge appearance for you in L.A. For the comedy stuff? For the comedy the stuff and for something else. Yeah. Another project with television. Ooh. Wow. Nice. Oh, you see TV for me? Anything? Anything? Yeah. <laughs> uh, you're going to be doing, but journalism has always been your passion. Yes. Um, journalism yeah. has always been your passion also. Yeah. But I, I see you like in being very passionate about women empowerment. Yes, yeah. she is. That's definitely. something very near to you. Girl. Um, definitely. All right. Yeah. <laughs> if it was like back in the day, she'd have totally been a Black Panther. Black I, Black I believe Panther that. Right. Right. She, she, she always wants to wear an afro. We're like, oh, no. no. She's like, I want to wear an afro. No. Angela James is like, no, no. Yes, I love it. I see that, like very mm -hmm. powerful about women yes. empowerment, women rights, mm -hmm. you know, doing the right thing, you know, yes. um, and that's phenomenal as well. Yeah. Um, and something, but I feel like you get that from a family member, like you have a strong woman in your family. Oh, yeah. Yes. Um, who is very yeah. like forceful, whether it be your mom and your grandmother. Um, my aunt and my mom. Okay, both yeah, because I'm them. seeing Very, them. very strong. Women. Yeah, strong yes. women, that's where you get it from. Um, and it's it's actually amazing, and I'm glad that you took that trait on. Yeah, 
Hey. Oh, that's really good too. And then with you, a book is coming up for me with you as well. What? Nice. Well, like the book. I don't know. Yeah. Like, a, I don't know. like a, a book or like an article in a magazine or something. You're going to be writing. I, oh. Have you been writing? Huh. I have an idea. I have an with idea. With a magazine or a blog or something like that? Magazine. Okay, because I'm yeah. saying magazine is, is coming up. Nice. Oh, that would be so nice. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. She's yeah. holding out on info. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Right now, it's just an idea for her. But see, that's the thing with me being a motivational spiritualist, right? People have ideas in their minds, but mm-hmm. they're not manifesting the ideas. Right. right. So as a motivational spiritualist, I'm like in your mind, pushing you to manifest <laughs> what's in your mind. Yeah. Like if right. it's a thought for right. you, and if you want to do it, then why is it just a thought? Bring right. it why aren't you doing it? Bring it to life. Right. Like live your life with a purpose. You know? True. With everything that you want to do. I don't care if you're doing 20 things at one time, do it. Right. right. Because you can. Right. So what about that's, little old me? That's a good. Well, yeah. So do that magazine. Get going with that. Okay. Okay, okay. please. Yeah, thank and you. for you, <laughs> all right. So all right, you got your business. Yes. Right. Um, makeup. Yes. I see that very strong, and I see you enrolling a lot of celebrities into your makeup brand, which yes. is absolutely phenomenal. That's a good way to market yourself. Um, but there's a lot of changes going on. Yes. Um, there's a lot of uncertainty. Um, with some things, not in a bad way, but you looking to grow quickly. Um, things are going in the right direction, but it's not moving as quickly as you predicted. I'm impatient. Yes. Right. Very. That Aries but you need energy. to be patient. It's the Aries. Mm-hmm. That's I want to tell everybody. Yes. You need to be patient too. Um, and then your car. Um, you have a beautiful car. I'm right. about to get rid of it. Yes. Yeah, I was about to say, beautiful car, but I was just about to tell you, it's time for you to get a new car. Yes, it is. Right, yeah, yeah. that's what I was going to tell you. What? Beautiful car. How does she know um, that? Now, look at that. How does she know that? Right. How you know she's not know. driving the hoopties? Yeah. See what I mean? Yeah. This she girl's the truth. See, I, know, I know what she's doing. Yeah. She drives me home a lot. Yeah, I know. yeah nice car, <laughs> but it's, it's something with the rudders, rotors. Something no, like nothing's wrong with it. It's just yeah. time for it to go, but it, it may have issues, but I don't know. It does have issues. It's brand new. Something's up with the rotors. Maybe any money need breaks. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Maybe. But it's time for you to get rid of it anyway. It doesn't yeah. matter. Don't spend no money fixing it. It's too expensive. I'm not. But I'm not. get your new car. Um, that, and what does, like, like we know the car too. that you drive. What? And so it's like white. The color white. You know, white? Her car's yeah. white. My Her car's white. white. Yeah. It represents, oh. um, I'm a little bit of a hypochondriac. I do okay. have, like, white sheets, white okay, towels, white Okay, that's what I'm saying, white. I said, what does white mean to you? Yeah. Because I think white is strong. Yeah, white is very strong. Um, uh-huh. I, like I'm very monochromatic. I either wear like a lot of black, or a lot of white. Yeah. I really don't wear a lot of patterns or colors or right. anything like that or plaids. Everything mm-hmm. is just pretty solid. But yeah. yes, all of my <gasps> towels, my sheets, my comforter, the pillow Her cases, car, everything, everything is white. white. Yes, she I see in that. your sheets, girl. I know. I'm like, <laughs> <"That's laughs> <funny." laughs> but, you know, don't talk about my sheets. Know, I've been, I've been, I've you know, been told that you know they thought it was a little bit crazy because everything was white. It was a bit of a hypochondriac. Mm-hmm. But just for me, I'm allergic to a lot of different dyes and things like that. So when I have like the white sheets and towels, I don't break out. Like right. dyes make uh-huh. me break out. So. That's as white. I'm like, what does white mean to you? White, 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 what? white, white. That's things so white. You yeah. know. Um, wow. But that's good though. But that's that's like awesomeness. I can't believe she knew that. That's so personal. Like, um. Like, so no, it's really good. I, I like that because you like purity. You like clarity. Um. But you need to start meditating. Yes. I do. Okay. It's because you have so much going on in your mind that you need to sit still. Slow down. Yes. Right. And the only way that you're going to sit still is if you meditate. Yeah. You need right. to really sit down. And I'm being serious with you. No, I, I know. It's in your app. Okay. A good app called Timer. Wow. Yeah. I you do. need Because it's just like you're all over the place. Like one minute you're doing this, then the next minute you're doing that, and then the next minute you're doing this. I mean, you get everything done. Don't get me wrong. Right. You get it done. <laughs> but by the time you get it done, you're so depleted and you're so exhausted. And it's like, why are you putting yourself through that? <sighs> It's supposed it's to be good help is hard to find. But that's it's why. supposed to be fun. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's it supposed fun, to be but, fun. But sometimes you have, um, a, you know, like variables that are in the equation that don't make it fun. You know, so that's like the downside of it. But overall, I, I'm very grateful and I'm very blessed and I'm, yes. you know, I'm extremely happy that, you know, I'm able to do the things that, that I do do. You mm-hmm. know?